Chinese truck I bought in 1988 and I took it all apart. I bought it for $200 and I took the motor out of it. It was an Oldsmobile motor and I sold the motor for $200. Oh, yeah. So it didn't owe me anything. <laughs> and then I just took it to the frame and new suspension in the front and rear. So it's got Chrysler front suspension, torsion bar, and it's got a Ford rear end in it in the Chevy truck. So yeah. I took it right to the frame and I just years and years and years just yeah that's a long time yeah I was uh, in the body shop for 15 months <laughs> getting the paint done on it so you had someone else do the paint but you pretty yeah, much built, built the else. truck yeah. yeah and uh it was pretty much rotten from about a foot up from all along so it was cut and weld and put all new pieces in. wow yeah and we drove this one down to uh reno Hot August nights down there. Oh, yeah. Um, the wife said, well, you, if we're going to go down there, you better put air conditioning in it. So I put air conditioning. Oh, that's cool. And what, did you do like a vintage air setup? or? It's called a keep be cool and it gets. Oh, yeah. It fits nice. Nice steering wheel, too. You took out the Oldsmobile and you put it, what did you drop in for an engine? I put a 350. This is a... A little bit hopped up. Oh yeah. It's a 1971 Chevy motor. Um, the heads on it I put on. I bought the motor. It was complete, but they had just uh, 194 heads on it. I put 202 heads on it, so they're out of a 1965 Chevy car. Oh yeah. 327. And it's what's just, it got for rear end? It's got a Ford nine inch with a 350 gear in it and a turbo 400 transmission on this oh yeah so it's pretty much bulletproof yeah absolutely yeah strong 400 and a ford nine inch yeah. did you do the wood yeah i did the wood uh when my dad was alive he does a lot of the wood stuff so i brought it over to him and i just bought bulk wood and we ran it through his planer and made all the grooves in it and and he helped me put it all together. Yeah, it looks really good. Now, was the were the mini tubs mm. the factory, or did you add those no, to get I your tires in? No, I put those in because yeah. they put wider tires in it. Right. Those are just from Prince's Auto. They're just trailer. Oh, yeah, good. And I just bought one of them and cut it in half, put one on each side, and welded it in. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, wow. That's a nice job. You'd never know. Like, the, the flat sides are done so well. Is that the, yeah, nice fuel cap? Yeah, so it usually has the fuel back here. Right. The seat. And the but tank was behind the seat the too, wasn't was it? There, yeah. But it was rusted out and it was all rotten back there. So I had to cut out the floor and put it all new. And then, so I built a new gas tank for the, the back of it. A new gas tank. Oh, you built it? Yeah. Oh, nice. I like your exhaust tips. Yeah. It's much easier coming out there than trying to go over the rear end. There's not yeah, much room on especially when it's this low. Yeah. yeah.